looking beautiful. It's a clear, calm, and cool night. The three C's is what we like to call the trifecta. Beautiful in Center City, adding a couple more C's to that trifecta there. Right now it's 72 in the city with a dew point at a comfortable 56 and a light breeze from the west, about 10 miles an hour. Cool and comfy down the shore at 65 degrees. The dew point is 59 there. And in the Poconos, it's downright chilly almost 54 right now you can see how much cooler it has gotten it's warmer in the city because of what we call the urban heat island effect which means all the concrete all the blacktop in the city retains heat a little bit better than grass out in the suburbs so we tend to take a little while to cool down where areas further af uh, further afield cool down a little bit more quickly storm scan three we've got clear skies all across the map nothing going on it's this big plume of dry air that has swept in and has us in its grip and we're going to be dry and comfortable with low humidity right through the end of the week and right into the start of the weekend before that moisture starts to creep back in. So overnight, mainly clear, light winds, the low in Philly, 62. That means the suburbs, many suburbs, will be in the mid-50s when you wake up tomorrow morning. It's going to be almost a little bit crisp tomorrow morning. We haven't felt crisp in quite some time around here. Tomorrow looks great, a cool start, and then a nice mild afternoon, tons of sun, calm winds. It is a picture-perfect Friday. We're checking all the boxes. Great day to be outside, and hey, maybe even get outside and go for a run, or even just a brisk walk. Either way, it'll feel like fall in the morning, refreshing and nice in the afternoon, and feeling that low dew point love right through the evening hours as well. If you're headed down the shore, picked a good day to do it. 79 degrees with abundant sunshine, perfect beach day. Ocean water temperature between 75 and 80 degrees. And if you have to work tomorrow and you're thinking about the shore for the weekend, that's also an excellent plan. But next week we're going to heat up. We're back to the 90s, Monday, Tuesday and Wednesday, close to records all three days. And not only that, it's going to start feeling a whole lot hotter. The next few days feel pretty comfy, feeling like the 80s. That's where we'll be. But by Monday and Tuesday of next week, it is going to feel like near 100 degrees as another heat wave sets up across the region. So nothing but sunshine. This is going to be our longest dry stretch of the summer by far. We're looking at eight days right here today counted as day one and now a seven day forecast full of sunshine, but it does get hotter. You'll feel a little uptick in the heat and humidity Sunday, but it's really Monday, Tuesday and Wednesday. It'll be hot. It'll be humid. We're right back into the into the thick of summer. So if tomorrow morning you walk outside and you're like, oh, it's too cool. It's too soon. I'm not ready for fall. Don't worry. Fall's, Don't not, worry. fall's not here. <laughs>